prepare for the cutest logos. Stop. alligator, that's him over there at that table, a mostly harmless and probably innocent reptile is at the center of a conspiracy that could bring down the biggest, scariest family in alligator New York City. His, um... So, this is a sort of point quick game. We gotta save Pat from whatever fate is possibly happening. Oh, it's a little tug and the... I stumbled across this game. I don't even remember where on now, and I was like, is this on Steam? Is this on Steam? And it is on Steam, and I'm sorry. First of all, just Alligator Cities, but the art style's adorable, and it all... Can I interact with anything else? So I gotta remember, I, I, I'm clearly a very fancy character. Did you see our shoes and the little starting, like, set animation walking in here? I guess it's Alligator New York City, maybe that's, you know, but... Patmet, no company, please, thank you. Uh, sorry, buddy. I gotta harass you. Um, no, no hablo, um, inglés, no hablo espanol, no hablos at all. Not even one hablo. Not even one hablo. Oh, he's trying. Look at adorable tooth. Yes, I wanna hug an alligator. Hey, hey I, I'm trying to lay low here, so can you maybe move on, please? That right there, I identified with Pat. <laughs> okay, okay, you got me. I'll come clean. Oh. I've never been so rude before. I'm just a little on edge. He says while doing this. <laughs> sure, you haven't just had too much coffee. Normally, I wouldn't tell anyone this, but you've got such soulful eyes. I can totally see the entirety of. So I'll feel <laughs> feel safe with you, stranger. See my eyes? Yes, trust me. Pat, trust me. You see, usually I love coming to John Johnny's on my birthday like this. Staying in the hotel, floating in the pool, eating two bagels at the Continental breakfast, eating two soaps in the complimentary bath basket. Hey, he's squeaky clean from the inside out. But this year, I've got a problem. A real big problem. A real, real, big, uh-oh problem. The thing is, I'm pretty sure the family is trying to rub me up for squealing. I didn't mean to squeal. Honest, I just see a pair of earnest eyes and the secrets just start flowing out my snoot. A bit like now. See? I'm doing it right now! He's self-aware, though. <laughs> oh, cheese and crackers. What am I gonna do? I don't want to be rubbed out. Two-ton Tony even told me I have to meet him upstairs here at 8 sharp for the event. They think I don't know, but I heard him talking to Big Mama on the phone. The whole family is gonna come to really show me how it's done. What am I going to do? I don't want to sleep with the fishes. I have a shellfish allergy and my asthma acts up when I get too waterlogged. Wait a sec. You're interested in me, right? You wanted to sit with me for breakfast and everything. You're an adorably animated alligator, of course. Since we're such great pals, you can go out and talk to my family around Alligator in New York City. Find out information about the event and report back to me. Yes, this is a great idea. 
together. Maybe we can collect enough info to sa save, save me. You want to save me, right? Right? Great. I'll text you if I need any help. How about you go out there and start? Do you have a watch? Sure do. Sure do. Oh, you do. Great. I'll text Lulu before 10 a.m. So it'll take 15 minutes or so to get back here in the trolley. Okay. So make sure you check your watch a bunch. If you happen to get stuck doing some weird game-like activities while we're investigating, it could take time. Time I don't have! Because I'm going to have a murder done on me! Uh, uh, I'm okay. Think of the beach, Pat. Remember what Dr. Duplesmith told you. Anyways, uh, thank you so much for helping out an alligator like me. I really feel better just looking at your super kind and visible face. Yes, yes. I agree with everything you just said. <laughs> and be careful out there. The last thing we need is two people sleeping with the fishes. We need to find... <laughs> We'd need to find a double bed in this economy! See you later, friend. Stay safe. I will try. You're new. Hey, he's looking right at me. <laughs> Bub. Hello, esteemed guest. If you're looking to leave the restaurant, you'll have to use the exit arrow up there in the corner of the screen. Oh, that handy one. Why, thank you. We provide all our patrons with an exit arrow and complimentary pillow mints. Feel free to use uh, both outside of our fine establishment to exit and munch as you wish. Just don't mix the two up since that arrow is vintage. <laughs> Valuable arrow. And known to contain harmful materials such as lead paint, asbestos, and a combination of rat poisons and cilantro. Please feel free to visit us stand here at John Tony's and have a Johnny of a day. They tried. God. Uh, okay, I'll... What time is it now? Eight. Okay, let's get out here. I just got an achievement for checking my time. This week I can drag up and down. John Johnny's Russian Cafe. Go down. Slick Mickey. Hey, bub. You got a minute? Or perhaps three minutes? I ain't, ask I ain't above asking for five. I saw you walking out John Johnny's over there, and I says to myself, Mickey, you gotta talk to that mysterious stranger. Vision and pinstripes, they is. I ain't trying to fluff you up or nothing, but you look like an alligator of exceptional taste. As well as one who might like to dabble in high-stakes games of chance and intrigue, if you feel me. No, don't actually feel me, I've got a skin condition. <laughs> i got a skin condition. They call me slick for a reason, and according to my doctor, I ain't going away and I'll start using that tropical cream at night. But I ain't got to listen to some jabberoni with a smarty certificate, you know what I'm saying? No, I don't know what you're saying. I was with you and not maybe using. Well, I knew he's probably not moisturizer, but yeah. I'm the lazy kind. He's the I'm not listening to what the doctor said kind. <laughs> Almost might just come from the street, which is also where I got the skin condition. My impolite lower back tattoo. The fuck? Uh, yes, it's Pat. Are you talking about Pat the alligator? Yeah, I know that dude pretty well. He's my second cousin. One time when we was kids, us guys got locked out of CCD after recess and missed juice and cookie time. We only had one granola bar between us, and good old Pat gave me the bigger half. I'll always sniff for remember that. No, I ain't crying. I just spit in my own eyes and display my street toughness. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, you know about the event. Eh, well, looky here, bro. It's a real secret affair, you dig? Nobody's supposed to be going and telling Pat about it. My lips are sealed, just like they're sealed when I wake up after a night of nose only breathing. <laughs> My name's Mickey, but everyone calls me the old king of the cards. Well, that one guy did before he yelled at the fence to stop stealing the email passwords. Fences, man. They keep going for passwords. Fences, man. They're just they're just pro hackers. Then his pants fell down. Sounds like he needs to yell at the belts. Then he fell down. Into an open manhole. 
but I have a good authority from the paramedics and you only called three or five people that, so better be your card king at your service. Oh! Yeah, what's uh maybe though. Just maybe. If you play a little game with me here, my lips might loosen up. I think you're gonna keep an eye on the flurry of pinkies and find the queen. Then your card and keep an eye on the cards. Do I have a choice? Like, come on, do I? In case we're in a street scam, keep an eye on the card on the queen and pick the correct card for his plans. Yes. I have no kind of eye keeping up things. Oh, I get you, Pete's feel, because these hands are about to become a hurricane. See here? Keep your eyes in the lane. Where's she gonna go? Where's she gonna go? Um. Um. <laughs> oh, he even gives it away. I, I mean, we don't. You never claim to be a pro. It's okay, Mickey. It's okay. This one. Why is it on fire? Mickey. Well, I guess we'll never know who won. Who knows which way the wind blows or some junk? That's. that's I mean, you're scamming me, so it, like, am I surprised you're cheating? But still. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for acknowledging my win. You got a family badge member. Oh, jeez. Anyways, about the event. Well, you ain't heard it from me, but I hear it's gonna be a real affair to remember. The whole family's been talking about it for months. That's really gonna get his, if you know what I'm saying. Anyways, thanks for playing. Let me know if you need any of my city smarts while you're out there, Rookie. Try not to lick any uh, trolley handrails if you can help it. Those dermatology cobays are a real kick in the alligator pants, you feel me? Oh. I don't want to know what he's been through.